This local sports report is brought to you by BFD Rona, a proud supporter of the Waterloo Siskins. BFD is home to Kitchener Waterloo's largest fence and deck showroom. BFD is also KW's only Rona store with a complete line of lumber, hardware, and building supplies. Whether you are a do-it-yourselfer or want a professional installed deck or fence, visit BFD Rona at Forwell Road and Victoria Street North in Kitchener or email experts at bfdrona.com. Matt Anuska back between the pipes for Game 6 in the Sutherland Cup semifinals. Anuska and the Waterloo Siskins trying to advance to the championship series for the first time since 1994. They hit the ice with a 3-2 series lead. The Niagara Falls Canucks coming off back-to-back -back wins looking to force a seventh and deciding game back in Niagara on Monday night. Opening period, Siskins power play. Alex Cimino, the captain, taking the return pass. He fires Zach Moore. Good save. And the Canucks kill off the penalty. Later, the Siskins once again with a man advantage. Cimino at the point to Sam Cherry. He skates in and snipes. Cherry getting Waterloo on the board first. They are up 1-0 after 1. Early in the second, here comes Niagara. Matthew Riva going to the net and a big collision with Matt Anuska. The Siskins netminder would be okay and he stayed in the game, still one nothing. Back the other way, a terrific chance for Brett Schaefer alone in front, stopped by Moore. Big save there and it stays a one goal game. Then Owen Holmes behind the net to Nicholas Prestia in the slot. Anuska coming through with a solid save. Still in the second, Andrew Bruno with a steal at the blue line. He's got a shorthanded break. Anuska with a pad save. But on the play, the referee calls for a penalty shot. So Bruno with a chance to tie the game. One on one versus Anuska. He skates in, goes to the backhand and and scores the Canucks back on even terms Bruno's ninth goal of the playoffs we are knotted at one after 40 minutes to the third Waterloo power play scramble in front of Moore loose puck in the crease and it's cleared away by Justin Schneider but moments later same man advantage Tyler Dam far side lets one go off Joseph Serpa's skate into the net Serpa's fifth goal of the play Playoffs gives Waterloo the lead. It's 2-1. Late in regulation now, the Canucks with an empty net looking for the equalizer, but it's Sam Cherry scoring into the open cage to seal it for the Siskins. Cherry's second goal of the afternoon, making it 3-1. And for the first time in over two decades, Waterloo will play in the Sutherland Cup Championship Series. They take it over Niagara 3-1 on Sunday and win the series in six games. Now it's a date with the London Nationals in the finals starting later this week. Matt Anuska, who missed game five, was solid in his return, making 35 saves, helping the Siskins advance. You know, definitely you know, a little frustrating to have to sit out there, but you know, it, it felt good to get back in there. And you know, I thought the boys played a great game overall. We you know, put a lot of pressure on them. We really wanted to come out here and win this, and we just did a great job today. It was devastating to see him go down, and obviously he's one of my best friends. Um, I, w I really felt on the bench. I was hoping for the best, but he worked really hard to um, be able to be here tonight, and he came through and he played an amazing game. I'm so happy for him. Um, he deserves all the recognition he gets. He's a great player, and um, I was just so happy to see him come through and play the game he did today. I got thrown out on the power play a little bit there, so I was pretty excited. Um, <laughs> I got to go on, and uh, I knew um, I had to try and uh, have the best shift of the game there because. Um, 
I was just trying to get back into it after the intermission, and uh, we uh, we went out. We were moving the puck pretty well, and then um, I saw the puck go to the far side, so I just tried to get to the net with my stick down, and uh, I was trying to look over Sesti, but I couldn't really see him. Next thing I knew, I was right, right off my skate and in. Uh, I had to look to the ref, make sure, uh, make sure it was all good, and then, yeah, it was just an exciting goal, yeah. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.